Don't forget what we do is oratory. It's rhetoric. Fear. A business with enormous power and global reach. Our spirit is eaten when we do not understand the distinction between the difference of authority and power. If they tell us money resembles power, then whoever has the most money has the most power. But that is a lie. Money, whoever gets the most money has the ability to get authority. But that is not power. But if we believe that, if we believe that money is power or can take us to power, then we will always understand that power is something removed from us and it's not a natural part of us. We, it's just so subtle and so blatant. If we believe that political systems are power, they're, they're manipulative, that's all that they are. They're just another way, a political system is a way of mining the spirit, just the same way the definition of authority and all of these things are ways of mining our spirit. So this is where someone like Judy becomes a threat because she understands that she has power and she understands the reality of responsibility that goes with power. She understands that. She, we can't communicate with her now the way that we used to, but we can communicate with her. That's life. That's spirit. In the ways of the tribes and in our common ancestry, we understood to pray with our ancestors. We understood the ones that had left before us, the ones that we were the descendants of. This was our power connection to knowledge. This was our power connection to the past and the power connection to the future. So when we enter into this, whatever has to come down in the future, I don't have the time to really go into it. too far. <laughs> But the antibiotic to dealing with these people, these vampires, and it is, it is a vampire, it is cannibalization. But the antibiotic to this disease is our intelligence. We were given intelligence by the Creator. We have intelligence. That is the antibiotic. That is the cure. There is no cure. There is no existing cure to the problem other than the one that we will create by using our intelligence as intelligently and as clearly as we possibly can. We use our intelligence, intelligence.